to compete in an elimination game for his team. Adebayo tips it back, but White able to hug it, and Chicago controls. A couple of days rest, and these type of moments, you're going to give everything you have to get on that floor. Here's Adebayo. Caruso comes sprinting down, but not in time to thwart Adebayo. Chicago's first two possessions. Adebayo draws two. Here's Hero. Hero elevates and hits. Elimination game in Miami. Winner takes the eight seed. Loser season ends. Jaquez stops, floats, and finishes. Jaime Jaquez, one of the best rookies. Jaquez hesitates, barrels in, and finishes. Plus the foul. A chance for three. An 8-0 response from Miami before falling to Denver. Off the rejection, Martin, the crossover, sets up Jaquez. You bet. You know, he misses you know, chunks of regular season each year, and the Heat obviously have next man up ingrained in their culture as Hero elevates and finishes over Vucevic. Talked about that with, with Coach Billy Donovan, just about how are they going to find the same shots as Tyler Hero misses the three and there is a foul. Can't finish. Robinson had missed the last few games of the regular season with a back issue. Getting first quarter minutes tonight as Jaquez is whistled for the personal and free throws here for Javante Green. Did you fill out a bracket? Are we going to track it to no, see no, if no, it's no, actually no. not that hard as you March surmised? Is, March is my only bracket. Okay. And Arizona let me down. They did. Jaquez fading can hit. Shot clock turned off here in a final possession. Knocking down threes. I think more disturbing is, is the points in the paint. They're getting destroyed points in the paint. 14 to 4 before that last uh, spin move here. That foul, by the way, number two on Jaquez. Stays on the floor here. Lob it into Drummond. Drummond, deep catch. 15 for 42. That was a career high in makes and attempts. Here's Jaquez into the paint. Able to regather and finish. And I love Jaime Jaquez, a four-year player at UCLA. I think we got a little glimpse of Rick Ross there sitting courtside, Richard. Rosé's in the building. Hey, ye. Have a, a shooter in the corner. If you're just trying to go downhill against Miami Heat defense, that is not how you attack them. Jaquez can't finish it. Well, and that's something really good possession here. Dasumu in and out on the three, but a really good looking set from Chicago. Oh, that was perfect offense there. Hero connects the floor in transition. And he's still a young player. These are things that come with time and growth. Jaquez, catch, fire, no. And this is an opportunity for Miami. Alex Caruso was a game time decision, but giving it a go tonight for the Bulls as Jaquez can't finish. Caruso comes away with it. A lot of that was Batum, but he, they got walked down. Hero will take and hit. Big three there for Tyler Hero. Here's Adebayo. Serves it underneath. Jaquez can't finish. Here comes Hero. The Rosen jockeying with Adebayo underneath as Jaquez storms to the rim. The eighth seed on the line tonight. Adebayo finds the cutter. It's Jaquez for the flush. That means a lot of movement. We just play with a lot more movement this way because they have to without the offensive skill of Butler. And Haywood Highsmith. I don't blame him for that. Centers don't like dribbling the ball more than twice. Hakez in the corner. No. White the weak side rebound. And Miami coming out in a zone right now. Highsmith comes up with a steal. Hero leaves. Hakez soars in for the flush. If you're Chicago, you have to almost prepare for it or run a play that works for both. Love, listen to you. He knows. And they got 67 points with eight to go. That's well below what they typically average. Oh, nice delivery. Love, Hawkins. Bucket. He 
was getting free throws versus smaller players or collapsing the defense and kicking it out for quality shots. And how about Love tonight? 16 points. Performance by the Miami Heat without Jimmy Butler. Richard, are you surprised at all by this after what we saw from Chicago the other night against Atlanta? I am. But look, Kobe White has 10 points. Last game against Atlanta, he had 42 points, nine rebounds, six assists, and zero turnovers. The drastic difference in those two games for that individual player, one of the candidates for most improved, but these are part of being most improved is being in these situations more as a dominant player, right? He's been here as a, as a role player, as a developing young player, but now the expectations are far different. So the Miami Heat have done it again. Second straight year, they claim the eighth seed with a victory over the Bulls.